Hey guys, Megan Lynn here. How are you? Spiritual Empress. How's everybody doing today? It is Thursday. I'm heading to Scottsdale, so if I'm a little bit distracted, that's why. Um, I'm driving right now, but I wanted to do another Aquarius video. Um, you guys seem to like those because I guess everybody's been really mentally fucked from an Aquarius at some point in their life. Um, I get a lot of people that will like email me for Aquarius stuff, um, so uh, I'm sorry for it. I speak for the Aquarian nation. If we've mentally fucked you, I apologize. <laughs> um, but yeah, I want to do a video about um, Aquarius when they break up with you or after a breakup, how they handle it, um, and also how they handle exes because I had a girlfriend. She was dating this Aquarius guy for like six or seven months. Um, it seemed to be going okay, but then there's kind of signs when an Aquarius pulls away, um, and it can be very cold and very hurtful. Um, but she basically was, she was really upset because he broke up with her. Um, she's really upset. I think her Venus is in a fire sign actually. So she's like looking at his social media and stuff. Um, and the funny thing too is like, I had like an ex reach out to me reach out to me recently and it's so funny because I always get socially stalked too and I like I never look at like once you're my ex you're my ex I don't look at your shit like we're done I, I don't need to know what you're up to or anything like that like there's no point in creeping on people's social media it just hurts I think for the most part um so anyway I had like I had an ex reach out to me too and this is like years later right and um you know just just know with an Aquarius how we handle exes we do not engage typically like we don't want to like once it's water under the bridge like it's done um, but he reached out and it was like really funny because I didn't have a feeling about it it was like a very brief kind of thing and he you know he was just like I just I feel really bad for how everything ended with me and you and blah 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 and like in my head I'm like well first of all I'm the one who ended it because you were like talking to other girls and I'm like not about that uh, second like why the hell are you like hitting me up right now and I'm very like if we broke up and it was on weird bad terms like don't hit me up don't like and especially if I end it with you like there there's no coming back from that you're not gonna pop up like two years later and it's gonna be different like I still have that same I've basically taken that cataloged you away in a file and that's where you stay is in that category <laughs> so um, anyway, my girlfriend was having, you know, she's having a really hard time because the guy that she was seeing, she's like creeping on his social media. Everybody creeps on Aquarius' social media. I'm going to tell you, like, after a breakup, we're always going to have pictures of having a good time. Um, and it's not, it's not because we don't care about you or we didn't care about you or we don't have feelings about the situation. You have to figure that Aquarius is the most intellectual sign of the zodiac, so... What Aquarius does after a breakup, um, especially if you broke up with them and they're actually really upset about it, they're not going to show it on the outside. It's all internalized. So that's stuff that they, they're going to be like going over arguments and scenarios and memories and, and feelings and things like that in their head. And um, the thing with Aquarius is because they are so mentally active. Um, it's very destructive to leave an Aquarius alone with their own thoughts when it has to do with negative ones because, um, and especially I would think ones with abilities too, could PK manifest some entities real quick. <laughs> um, but it's very, they can become very destructive um, if they're just going over negative feelings, um, you know, they have heartbreak, things like that. Um, so what they do is they do throw themselves out with friends, with hobbies with their pursuits um you know them out having a good time is not a lie they're out having a good time but it's it is it doesn't mean that they're not hurting or that um you know they honestly just can't be alone with themselves or they can't be alone with um those thoughts because like I said they will just go over and over and over it in their head 10 million times um so I just kind of wanted to talk a little bit about that like people you know she's like oh it's like it never existed and you know she's pretty like bitter about it but like that's not true um I could say though if he broke up with her it's, it's something that Aquarius doesn't make rash decisions like that especially if um you know we're not wanting to lose somebody who's been our friend um or we consider to be a close friend um, so for me, I mean, she can be a little bit hot headed, which an Aquarius can usually simmer a little bit, but I could see her maybe have, I mean, if Aquarius breaks up with you, 
it's been either a long time coming or maybe you just crossed some line um, maybe you just went too far I can say be very careful about like what you say around an Aquarius because um, honestly we have like this switch so say you like I don't know every Aquarius has different lines because we are humanitarians we're very respectful of other people um, so when you're maybe arguing or stuff what I find with like fire signs people with high fire energy or water energy is um, there's a lot of people there who go too far uh, maybe they call you like a bitch in an argument or something like that and then this switch just goes off and once that switch goes off you're like dead to them <laughs> um, so I could see that maybe that maybe that happened and honestly if the switch goes off they really probably don't care if they dropped you um, but I, you know I don't she didn't really like give me like the whole story or anything but yeah Aquarius does have feelings we do think about things a lot and that's why we have to stay active um, because we can't be alone with our thoughts um, it, like I said it's very destructive I know a lot of Aquariuses who are suicidal I know a lot that um, you know don't really enjoy this existence down here um, and it's because um, if they've isolated themselves too, they're just stuck with their own thoughts. Um, it's very, very, um, damaging. So yeah, don't ever think that Aquarius like really just dropped you out of nowhere and, you know, doesn't have any feelings for you. That's not true. Um, that's just how Aquarius kind of processes, um, breakups and exes like stay away. <laughs> like, especially if the Aquarius broke up with you, like you're, you're dead to them. Like it just is. <laughs> It's so funny because people, I and I get this all the time, is like people come out of the woodwork, man. And I know that that's just kind of like guys, like they say guys just come back around um, more so with me than, than the average person. I can say my friends just can't believe it sometimes, the people that come out of the woodwork and, you know, want to want to re-engage with me like it's not happening <laughs> it's just really funny and anyway it was so funny because he like reached out and I normally I don't entertain normally I'm like what's because I still respect people as like actual humans like and I'm that person like if you reached out to me and you're stuck on the side of the road I'll come freaking pick you up like I'm I'm that person like I still respect you as a person even if we're not together anymore um I'm I'm just that's how I am with everybody um so it was funny because I like momentarily engaged with him and then he, he was back to the same old shit and it's the funny thing is my bullshit meter is so fast now I didn't even need to talk to them that much um, to catch the little things in there that are like manipulative um, or narcissistic um, I hate that kind of behavior so um, tends to be a lot of cancer guys I don't know why cancers are so freaking attracted to me like there's there's no real interest there like <laughs> They always really, really want to get to know me, and, like, I get really, really bored really fast, so, <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, if you guys have any comments, like, shares, anything like that, I was just letting you know how an Aquarius handles a breakup, it's not, we're not being assholes, that's, I mean, sometimes we are, but, um, it's really, if they broke up with you, they're over it, um, also, I mean, they still did their, their kind of grieving, but, yeah, when you see them on social media, I'm, honestly, don't creep on a Aquarius' a social media, um, it'll probably just hurt your feelings. So, yeah, guys, um, if you want to like, comment, share, anything like that, um, let me know what you want to hear about. Um, thank you for all the new subscribers. Um, it's growing kind of fast the last, like, week or so. I've gotten a lot more subscribers. Um, so thank you, thank you um, to all the new subscribers here. If you want to hear about anything specific, I'm revamping the website, so please let me know. I can make new sections for those things. And, um, yeah, just let me know so I have something to go off of because right now I pretty much make up my own material and it's just stuff that kind of pops in my head. So um, thank you so much, guys. I love you and we'll talk soon. Bye.